Hi everyone, welcome back. Um, something a little bit different today. I'm gonna try something that I've not tried before. I've wanted to for a long time, um, but to be honest, it scares the living crap out of me. No, slight exaggeration. It does scare me a bit. I'm gonna try and find some mushrooms. Um, as I say, I've never done this before, but I did watch a video last night by Dustin. Um, and I think I can now recognize chanterelles and winter chanterelle and hedgehog. So yeah, I've got my wellies in the boot. I've got a Tupperware tub. I haven't got a wicker basket or anything cute like that. And I've got my camera. It's raining, it's wet, so it should, the condition should be good. I've got my wellies. If you're watching this, then I've found some. If you're not, then I haven't, and this is a waste of time. So, anyway. Uh, I've, it's about seven miles, 20 minutes away where I'm going. Um, I need fuel, so I'll do that. And then, yeah, I guess next time you see me in a split second, I'll be in the woods. And I still literally have no idea what I'm doing. There's a stream down there. So I think I'm gonna head down to the bottom. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm doing it. I'm finding mushrooms. Got some what I believe are brown puffballs. After a quick Google search. Um yeah. <laughs> I've got mushrooms. Right, let's carry on. I think I found some hedgehog mushrooms, but I think they're definitely on the turn. They're very, very squidgy and slimy and mold, mouldy looking. So they're on the turn, but there are hedgehog mushrooms here as well. Well, I'm quite excited now. Right, I'm gonna try a different area. Um, surprisingly for me, the higher ground the more there are, appear the more there appear to be. So I've got some more puffballs, but I've only stayed in this area. There's another one there, but I've only stayed in this area. So I'm going to go further afield over there to see if anything changes. Right, I've been. Wandering around for about 10 minutes, and I've not found anything else, which is a little bit demoralizing. Don't know, maybe I've, I've left it too late in the year. Don't know. Those um, hedgehog ones weren't looking too perky. Maybe I've left it a bit too late. But 
it's very hard to point out those winter um, what they called chanterelles obviously they they designed to blend in to the deadfall anyway but there's so many chestnut husks on the floor as well makes it very difficult to spot them if there are already but I'm not in any rush I'm getting wet but other than that I'm all right so I'll just keep mooching about there's a mine mine shaft there that capped off that's another thing to be wary of but yeah I'll keep looking keep looking Not sure what they are, but they don't look very edible to me. That's probably okay, but. Again, it's looked a bit aged, a bit too far gone. Ooh, what's this one? What's that? Have a look at that. I'm absolutely soaked. Right, let me try and work out what this one is in a minute. God, it's so hard to find out what they are. If anybody knows, leave it in the comments. I'm going to take it with me anyway and try and do a bit more homework when I get home where I'm not getting soaked through. But yeah, I'm going to take it. But if you do know what it is, please leave it in the comments below. Thank you very much. It is a beautiful woodland. One of my favourites, for sure. <clears throat> Different view through every window. 
amazing. But I've been here hundreds of times, that's not what I'm here for today. Stop getting distracted. Have a look up there, shall we? Not sure, but it looks all right. Just found this, don't know what this one is yet, but I'm gonna have a look. I've just seen this one. I think that's obviously poisonous. Size of that bugger. Oh, is it? See, I don't know if that's black because it's gone off or if it's supposed to look like that I don't know is that part of it no that's a wooden stump that is Raymondo not much cop today I don't think they'd keep you very sheltered today. Good to see them. Good to see. Right, I think that'll do me for the minute. Let's, get, let's go and get this book, get home and try and find out what we work out what we've got. Um, just been just met a couple of girls back there. Uh, Abby and Tyler. Um, one of them asked me what I was doing, so obviously I said I'm like, what I'm looking for, also I'm looking for mushrooms and stuff, but I don't really have a clue what I'm doing, that sort of thing. And that was it. Anyway, I carried on going for a little bit longer. I came back round and they're still there by the same tree that I saw them by. And they're basically holding, they've got their hands flat against the trunk of the tree. Um, just standing still looking at the tree. One at a time, not both together. And they're sort of taking turns in it. So, so I went back and I said to them, can I ask what you're doing? And she said, yeah, basically they're sort of using the tree as like a connection to earth and nature and stuff. And they ask the tree yes or no questions and their body will uh, inadvertently, is that the right word? No, I don't know. Uncontrollably, your body will move whether or not it's a yes or if it's a no. So I said, it's like a natural magic eight ball then. And I was like, oh yeah, basically, pretty much. Which I thought was pretty cool. I'll try and, I'll Google it in a minute and try and See if I can get up on screen what, what they were actually doing, because I, I don't understand it, to be honest. But, um, each, you know, each to their own. They were, enjoy, they were out enjoying themselves. They were getting something from it. So, Abby and Tyler, if you are by any miracle watching this, nice to meet you. Um, and I hope you got the answers you were both wanting, I guess. in there. Right, I think I'm going to leave this one here. It's wet, it's miserable, can't find my car key. Um, 
so yeah i mean i don't know if it's been a massive success or not yet but got my little book got my shrooms god knows what's in there so um i'm gonna go home try and identify some of those and then maybe have some mushroom for my tea but anyway yeah thank you very much for watching if you have been this far um as always i do appreciate it um if you are new as i say this is a new i've not done this before so there'll be new tags i would imagine on the video attached to the video so if you have come here from somewhere else and if you are new please consider clicking the subscribe button and yeah as i say thank you much for watching click here to subscribe click here to see a video you might not have seen before and click here to see my woodland playlist thank you again for watching cheers and gone